Hello Leos, welcome to Bravely True Tarot and uh, this reading is from 16th of June to 22nd of June so let's check what is the message for you and uh, what you can expect in love in this week messages for Leos King of Adams, Ten of Chalices, Five of Chalices, Three of Adams, and Harvest. Okay, so here we have Three of Adams. With the Three of Adams, looks like you people are going through a tough phase. For many of you, this could be about separation after having this beautiful connection. The Ten of Chalices is here. That means you might have something very special with this person. Many of you might be married. And uh, you might be going through a divorce process or something. Or this could be about a situation which is out of control. And there is no option but to separate. And this separation seems to be permanent. With the Three of Atoms. Looks like something is going out of your life forever. And um, you may not know how to deal with this situation. And it's about um, accepting the truth. Leo, possibly you people are hurt at this point. But Tara is reminding you. Is this something uh, that you wanted? If it is, then you are losing. If it is not, you are not losing anything. Because I see this king of items. This could be someone who was not treating you right. Who has become toxic. Or probably you have been in a toxic relationship for a long time. Making it work somehow. Looks like you people were having um, this struggle. You had to keep this relationship in control. And um, this time things are getting out of hand. And by control, I don't mean that you were trying to dominate or you were trying to control this person. It was simply about not losing it. Maybe it was being too hard to keep. I mean, this relationship. And uh, at this point, there is no turning back. You people might be thinking that this is the only way out of this situation. And probably for many of you, it is. This person might be treating you in this way for a very long time. And uh, after this ten of chalices, we have this five of chalices. So many of you might be already regretting being in love with this person. Many of you might be asking universe why I met this person in the first place. If it was not going to work in the future. If this person was not meant to be with me. A lot of questions can be there. But the universe is telling you that uh, you will see soon with this card of harvest. You will get all your answers. You will get all the rewards you deserve. And in fact, it's about getting something in many folds. So if it is actually um, happening in your life, that means it's clearing your way. This is not something you deserve, Leo. This is not the way you should be treated. And uh, that is why universe is removing this toxicity from your life. In fact, this king of atoms might be silent. This person might not be talking to you even. And uh, this person feels like they are not supposed to initiate any contact. They are not supposed to reach you. They are not supposed to take any step from their side. This person feels that their silence is going to break you their silence is going to make it work maybe you will beg you will chase them this person forgot that you are leo and um, this is not possible <laughs> with this card of harvest this is about uh, making place for something that is waiting for you around the corner i see something coming for you and many of you can get this uh, reward in this very week or probably this is something that will follow soon after this separation okay so this is about making space for the right person 
and for the right things. However, this is a general reading. This might not resonate with everyone. The energy could be reversed as well. Also, you can check your moon and rising sign. Let's go ahead and check some more messages for you. Two of Pentacles. King of Chalices. The Sun. Three of Wands and queen of atoms okay first being this king of atoms and then complaining that you are being this queen of atoms it's like they have every right to say whatever they want to act uh, according to their will but when it comes to you this person expects you to simply accept whatever they are doing if you act or if you say anything in reaction that is not acceptable this person starts judging you so this person is silent and uh, they are not approaching you and when you will do the same this person will say leos are really stubborn leos are simply out of control they don't uh, value this relationship they didn't even look back they simply walked away with the three of atoms they even didn't uh, turn back okay they didn't uh, look at them even once king of chalices was expecting everything from you okay this person was expecting this marriage this love this settlement from your side and they had this expectation that leo you will keep it uh, working you will make all the efforts and you will never run out of your patience and now when you are mirroring them when you are showing them who they have become by doing what they did in fact you haven't even done what they did you are simply giving this reply silence by silence and uh, whatever question they have you are giving the befitting reply this is making this person restless okay they are judging you for this but the thing is this person knows that nobody can take your place this person knows that you are this loyal person and uh, most importantly you people are made for each other this person feels like you are someone who is perfect for them they know deep inside their heart that uh, you are irreplaceable but still making it look like they don't care we have this two of pentacles i see that this person is already having second thoughts about uh, not taking this initiative okay they are thinking about it this person is constantly thinking what if what if leo walks away what if leo forgets me what if leo chooses someone else i will have no way to be the love of their life because with this king of chalices seems like um, this person is still thinking about um, this past and they just can't get over it so it looks like their heart and mind are in totally different direction their mind is telling them that they don't need to uh, approach you. you you people don't need any kind of reconciliation there is no way out three of eight and should follow you should separate and um, live your own life but here their heart is telling them can you really replace leo can you really find someone who can be like them with this card of sun it's about uh, realizing that you have taken the first step towards your own freedom you have, um, you know, walked out of the darkness. Here we see three of items and then we have the sun. It's about walking out of the darkness and finally seeing the sun. With the three of wands, it's start of a new journey. So Leo, Star is telling you that you are doing fine. You are doing perfect. Your higher self is appreciating you for choosing yourself over everything. For saving your self-esteem and... Uh, for doing the right thing in spite of being so connected in spite of um, having so many emotions you are choosing this way this journey to a place where you will feel complete it's something worth um, a lot of appreciation and that is what your higher self is telling you you are doing the right thing listen to your intuition and um, embark on this journey without any second thoughts
Let's check an oracle message for you. Altar, a sacred devotion, a worship skin deep, rising from the ash, the waters you keep. So this is about worshipping yourself, Leo. You are supposed to devote yourself to your own soul, to your own heart self. Listen to it. Your higher self is giving you the right direction. It's giving you the message you need to listen. So there is something that is uh, rising from deep within. And uh, you should not let those feelings go. You should not let those intuitions um, be unnoticed. You need to, to see clearly and think clearly before taking any step okay so this was the reading for this week i hope you enjoyed it thanks for watching till next video bye